This is Tammy Bradford, and we are thick in the action at Olympic Fitness Club for their awesome fitness event. And I am thrilled to be here with Jamie Tirabasso. Look at this bod. This has come from hard work and dedication, some blood, sweat, and tears. Holy cow. I saw Jamie yesterday, and I, my jaw about dropped because she looks phenomenal. She's a little covered up right now. Yesterday we saw a little more skin and we're going to be showing you some of that later. But Jamie, tell us how you came to this event this weekend. What brought you here? Well, actually, um, I was picked out on Facebook. They saw my first photo shoot I ever did with Eric and I was chosen and asked to be here today and I'm very excited to be here. I'm so excited that you guys picked me to come out. We have the top-notch folks here, and I can see why Miss Jamie was invited to participate in this event. As you can see, she is buff and beautiful. You, have, you must have been training for quite some time. Can you tell us how you got started in fitness? How long have you been training? Absolutely. Um, I started training in fitness probably around the age of uh, 23. After a hard party lifestyle, I woke up and I was skinny fat and I decided to start working out. Um, as I was working out, I met a lady and she mentioned to me about doing competitions. And I said, oh, I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. And then about three or four years later, I finally did my very first show. I did okay. And um, it wasn't with the NPC. And uh, I decided a couple years later that I would try again. And I did. And I had a phenomenal season. I won first place at Vancouver Natural 2013. I won the overall title at uh, Oregon Ironman 2013. I also won the overall title at Oregon State 2013. And I got first place in my class at Seven Feathers in 2013. And uh, I just been I've been doing really, did really well that year. I'm very proud of it. It was a very stressful year uh, trying to get all those competitions in, but I was on a roll and I decided to strike while the iron was hot. And, that is a lot of contest prep in a short period of time. How do you handle that, not just physically, but mentally? That's got to be draining. Well, my husband definitely supports me a lot. Uh, you know, I'm a full-time trainer, full-time mom. Um, that season was especially hard because uh, I worked full-time plus overtime. Um, my clients really supported me. God bless you guys. I love you guys. That cannot have happened without you, Roberta. Everybody, you know who you are. Thank you so much. Angie, Dawn, thank you guys. Um, I just really appreciate everybody that came out to help me that year, and I, I really do love you guys. Uh, my husband supported me a lot. Um, we were going through hard times, so he was doing most cooking and prepping for me. He really, you know, dealt with a lot of cattiness and craziness, and I couldn't have done it without him. So I love you too, honey. Thank you. Um, God's really blessed us to, for me to be able to do that, considering our income and whatnot. You know, I don't, I'm not driving. I walk to work. It was really been a struggle, and I won those shows wearing a a, a great suit, but definitely not um, one of the higher end ones. Thank you, Miss Mary Stringfellow, for that suit. And um, I mean, I just want to keep going. I'm probably going to be changing divisions this next year, so I'm looking forward to doing that and seeing how I place, seeing that I put on a little bit more size in the off season, and I'm going to probably do my women's physique debut next year. Well, she's killed it in figure, so it's only going up to physique from here. And I am sure with your work ethic and dedication, you're going to do amazing. And I have to say, you know, when Jamie talks about the challenges that she has had to balance family, hard times with family, struggles, that lifestyle of go, go, go when you're prepping for all of those shows. If you really want to do something, you can do it. You just have to find a way, make a way. Fortunately, Jamie had some support, and we all need that in whatever way, shape, or form it comes. Friends, family, people in the gym that we, we know, workers, coworkers, um, trainers, whoever the people in your life are that can give you that support. But thank you for, for giving us that, that inspiration and that knowledge that you know you can get out there and do it regardless. Absolutely, no matter what your budget is, if you want it, you plan for it, you can do it. I've proven it and I'm gonna do it again, so. I believe her and we are gonna wait for her to take all those overall trophies again in physique. Beautiful lady right here. We are gonna be bringing you more from the Olympic Fitness Club event and we will also be bringing you more on Jamie here. She's got some fitness photography coming up with Rob Sims, the king of fitness. So don't go away, y'all. We'll be coming back at you with more.